kuingia kwa serikali ya Kibaki ukaanza kumsumbua ukamsumbua miaka tano. miaka tano. 2007 ukasim, 20 2007 ukasimama ukaanguka again ukasema i've been rigged ukaleta vita ukaingizwa ndani tukafanya nusu mkate ukatusumbua tena miaka ngapi miaka tano. 2013 we won ukaleta vita tukakaa ngumu 2017 we won ukaleta vita uhuru ndiye huyo akanunua uoga tukaenda hard shake tukakuwa na shida miaka ngapi ati sasa unafikiria unaweza leta hizo shida zako tena ile script yako ya miaka 30 tondo ambili die mbara inonekana na sasa mimi ni mama mzima na watoto wangu bado unatusumbua wewe mzee shetani ashindwe na unafikiria sasa utatuletea shida zako tena ati tukue sijui sijui sasa utaita handshake ama utaita story gani lakini tumekataa kata we are tired of you Raila Odinga we are very tired of you take a break retire you need to retire and let other people from your region take leadership progressive young upcoming leaders kama malala hivi not you you are now you need to retire my friend na huyu mama wetu wa huku my sister karoa <coughs> so so tunamwambia hivi wewe kama ni ndume vile unajifanya kule Nairobi leta hiyo maandamano yako kirenyaga toko tambure toko tambure madha karoa toko tambure kanatia leta maandamano ko goko enough is we are tired of your shenanigans to our president william ruto and your deputy rigiji ambaye tunamheshimu mukangangare musiwekwe uoga na mtu yeyote simameni na agenda yenu ya Kenya ensure Kenya goes to the next level na sisi tuko nyuma yenu hebu niwaulize mnataka hardshake nataka ikifikie William Ruto na Rigiji mnataka hardshake Ebu nione kwa mikono mnataka hardshake Watu wa Kerenyaga wa anu wa igoro wamekataa hardshake Wanakorea embu toraugire maandamano no 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 na hata hardshake atutaki Kwa hivyo SG si umejionea Ukirudi Nairobi peleka hiyo report umeona hapa Hao watu wamekataa mambo ya na wanasema wakae gangare and this government must continue to serve the people of Kenya because they were duly elected by the people of this country and William Ruto won na nyinyi mlikuwa mnatuweka uoga ati mtashinda because nyinyi mko na deep state na sijui mko na system mbona mulishindwa alafu mnakuja kutusumbua We were actually the underdogs but we won because God stood by us. Kwa hivyo msituletee jameni. And those demonstrations must come to an end because they are no longer peaceful. Na mzee apumzike. Mzee afanye nini? Apumzike.